All right, normally, when things are normal and we're not in a pandemic, I travel to different destinations every weekend. So I don't have time to sit down and read a book. But now I have the time and no excuses, and I have a good one. And I'm into it very much. My guy that I, you know, been watching for a very long time. He's about a year or two older than I am, but I remember when he first won Mr. America. And the book is called Driven, My Secret Untold Story Based on a True Story. And it's the story of Tony Pearson, Mr. America. And he had won a whole bunch of other titles, especially mixed pairs, but Mr. America is one I remember the most because Mr. Mer America was it when I was a kid. That was even more popular or more uh, looked up to or revered than Mr. Olympia at that time. So I'm on chapter four now. Let's see. Mom's next trip, she told me later, was to Memphis, the lawyer's office, to help her reclaim us children. Um, they had become separated, Tony and his siblings. She wanted full custody because of dad's violence. We have that in common, Tony. Uh, dad's, his dad was very violent and so was mine. John Lewis was six foot, a Caucasian in his 60s with a head full of gray hair with a reputation for honesty and respect. He had been practicing law for over 36 years and was considered one of the best attorneys in Memphis. He came well recommended to mom and had, and mom had high hopes of getting us back. She began telling him her story. She said, in the beginning, my husband Sam was very attentive and caring. We were happy together. I had no idea why his personality began to change. Then it seemed as if I was living with a different human being, a different man I didn't know. Mom paused and took out her handkerchief out of her purse to wipe the tears away from her eyes. Then she continued. He became very abusive and controlling. How long did this go on, asked Lewis? Several years, and it got worse and worse. Was it both mental and physical? Yes, sir. He called me every degrading name you can imagine. It was extremely hurtful. Finally, I just couldn't take it anymore. I was scared to death of him. He threatened my life numerous times, especially when he was drinking, which was most of the time. That's just the portion. It's good in reading. Check it out. Driven by Tony Pearson, My Secret Untold Story.